So, um, Mary, I mean, what's the rush? I mean, uh, do I have to make a decision right away? You are, are you serious about what you're doing? Well, yeah, I like the house and everything, but I've never bought one this fast before. Usually we think about it. My wife and I talk about it. Uh, we check our finances and everything. I mean, do I have to put a deposit, sign a contract, make a commitment right now? Uh, how about not right now, but how about at four o'clock today? I'll think, yeah, um, maybe I'll call, maybe I'll call you at four o'clock. That's great. Thank you. You're a great guy. No, no, no. Let's not do maybe. Maybe, maybe the sky won't be here at four o'clock. I mean, then we won't I need an to answer, a commitment. Put your balls on the line, man. Come on. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Now you went a little. Okay, now you. Too, now, is too he far. Nurturing? No, no, no. <laughs> Guts is about stroking and nurturing. Okay, I'm not a bad okay, guy. Okay. I'm not a bad guy. I'm just a nervous guy. Okay, okay. who wants to take over? Who wants to take okay. over, can, Mario? Can I go? Yeah, go please. Let's let Assad have a shot at it. Hey, Claude. Hey, I greatly appreciate you asking that question, though. And I completely understand where you're coming from, though, because when I purchased my first house, I was nervous. I was scared. I had always rented what's a he, house. What's he doing? What's he doing brilliantly right now? In the um, Betsy. Commonality. Tell personal story and related. Third, yeah, third party story. Being relatable. Yeah, all good answers. All of you had great answers. Perfect. Asad, go, I'm sorry to interrupt. Go ahead. Gotcha. Hey, Claude, you know what? I greatly appreciate you for asking that question. And you know what? I'm just going to be up front with you. I, I felt the same way that you're feeling right now. You're nervous. You're scared. I was the same way when I purchased my first house about a few years back. I, I, I was afraid that I was going to overpay. I was going to make a mistake. And yeah, I totally get where you're coming from. Do you just want me, do you want me to lie to you or do you want me to tell you the truth? No, the, uh, the truth always, of course. Okay. The truth of the matter is, Claude, I think that this house would be perfect for you and your spouse. You said earlier that your wife, she was afraid of living in the neighborhood. You said that your son was, I mean, every, every time you guys went to school, he was always getting bullied. You know, you guys had pit bulls roaming around the neighborhood. There was a lot of violence going on. And you want a safe and quiet place that you can raise your family where you don't have to worry about your son getting bullied. You don't have to worry about your wife being terrified of what's going to happen to her when she walks down the street. Let me ask you this. Suppose there was a way that we could work it within your budget and that we could get you into this home and keep it within your budget without paying extra. That's something you wouldn't want to do, Claude, is it? Well, when you put it like that, I guess I got to make a decision here. I really appreciate your understanding. Um, how much do you need down to for us to do? I, I want to do this. How much do you need for me to make a commitment right now? That's a, real, that's a really good question, Claude. Uh, how much are you comfortable putting down? Uh, maybe we can, maybe we can make some work. What would be a comfortable fit for you? Okay. Would $5,000 do it? Let me, let me, Let's give, give me a up. second here. Okay. Time out. Time out. Is every, what did he just do that I love? He's great at this. What did he do? <clears throat> He's struggling. He's struggling. What does the amateur do? Oh yeah, five thousand. That's great. What did what did Assad do? Very well. He struggled, baby. What does that say to the prospect when he's struggling? I'm beating him down on the price and getting a better deal. He's stimulating the ego of he's stimulating the ego of the prospect, isn't he? Wow, you sure got one over me, Mr. Prospect. Wow, no one's ever asked me that before. Wow, I've never done it for 5,000 before. Boom. When you only want, maybe Assad only wanted 2,500, by the way. Okay. Right. What's, which is the other rule? First to mention price always. Always loses. Always, always loses. Lo but there's a continuation on that rule. If, if the first, you can't go around more than once on the first to mention price. 